I want to show you a very cool tuning features on a smart chord. They have three different ways of tuning your ukulele. We have a tuner, we have a tone generator, and a pitch pipe. So let's go with the most simple one, that's the pitch pipe. We have G, C, E, and A. Those are the strings of your ukulele. It's currently set to standard or high G. You can change that by going to change tuning and clicking on low G. So we'll change that back to standard or high G. The nice thing about the pitch pipe is as you tap on a string, it repeats itself. And that makes it a lot easier to tune your ukulele without having to keep tapping your app. You use your ear to listen for the resonating tone and you pluck your string. You should have a nice smooth wave sound to it. So that's a pitch pipe. Let's go to what I like the best and this is the tone generator. Now A is tuned to 440 Hertz but I like to tune mine to 432 um, unless I'm playing with other people then I'll stick to 440 but this is really nice because it generates a tone. Let's actually change it to 440 pretty simple you can see it in red, 440 hertz. That's A4. Plucking and turning my key to listen to that resonating wave on the A string. It has a fairly decent wave to it. It's a little faster. That could probably go a little bit sharper on on my string. That's pretty close. So what you're listening for is that nice wave motion. Now they have another tuner and that's the actual tuner in the app. They have several different modes. Uh, in this case it's the simplest mode and you see a bar graph going from flat to sharp. These are your strings, G, C, E, and A, standard ukulele. Pluck the G string. Well, a little bit flat. So I might up that. There we go. And it gives a little vibration when you're on the button. Go to our C. That's good. E. E. Let's change our setting to detailed. Detailed, you'll see the graph is going from flat to sharp, much finer. So it gives you a little more resolution when you're ed when you're tuning your string. And also, you'll notice it shows the actual hertz. So my G right now is about 391. Should be a little bit higher. Too high. And that sounds good to me. Let's go to our A string, which is 440. And that's... 439 or 440, that's pretty close, that's very good. E string, 329, it's on the button. C, 261, that's pretty good too. We'll go to settings. You have mode, detailed mode or the um, basic mode. The pitch. I use 432 for most of my ukes. You can go to 440 as the standard or anything between 400 and 480. Frequencies. You can have the frequency of the note shown and that's where it's ranging between uh, 439 and 440 and 444 for example. The head. You can have the picture of your headstock display which shows you your G, C, E and A. You can also have the audio signal 
of the bar graph and also vibrate. As soon as you reach the correct pitch, your phone will vibrate. You can choose your instrument and a whole lot of other settings. So let's go back and you can also change your instrument. And there you have it, three different methods of tuning your ukulele using SmartCord. It's, it's totally awesome. I, I really love this app. And it's getting better and better all the time. They're constantly updating this thing.